Kaplan International Colleges um, offers English as a second language courses to students in many locations all over the world. We have three locations here in New York City. The students are the best thing about the job. Sometimes they're the only good thing about the job. I feel like teachers at Kaplan are not supported by the administration. Um, the company itself doesn't seem to value what we do in the classroom. We don't get any vacations uh, or more importantly sick days because if I get sick then I have to make the decision on whether I want to make other people sick or whether I don't want money. I think Kaplan could afford to give teachers benefits and real pay. In 2012, Kaplan made $49 million in profits. They gave their former CEO who left in disgrace a $76 million golden parachute. That's equivalent to the salaries of 3,000 Kaplan teachers. Students pay a lot of money for the experience they have at Kaplan and teachers see a really minimal amount of that. I don't want to exaggerate and say they're like a multi-gajillion dollar company, but it seems like a gajillion dollar company, and I'm an English teacher, so I know that that's not a real word, but they have so much money, and they, they just, you know, like a lot of corporations in America, they give the money to the shareholders. They give the money to the people at the top. I joined the Newspaper Guild because I'm a trained, qualified teacher. I have three years of experience. I have a certificate of English language teaching to adults, and I get paid minimum wage for a big part of my job. What I would ask people to do is to support us online, first of all, by signing our petition. Sign our petition. So you can like our Facebook page. You like the page on Facebook, Teachers and Students for a Better Kaplan. Tell everyone you talk to what is happening at Kaplan. We need your support. Education is something that's hugely important. It's in the news all the time. It doesn't happen without teachers. So we need your support. <laughs>